Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In a notable shift in the dynamics of global arms exports, Russia has descended from its long-standing second-place ranking to third, according to a detailed report by the Stockholm International Peace Research Institute, CIPRI, highlighted in a publication by the British Ministry of Defense, MOD, Intelligence Service on March 17, 2024. CIPRI's latest data reveals a stark 53% reduction in Russian arms exports between the comparative periods of 2014 to 2018 and 2019 to 2023. This decline in arms exports is further underscored by a year-over-year -year comparison, indicating a significant 52% decrease in volumes from 2022 to 2023. Moreover, the reach of Russian military hardware has noticeably contracted, with only 12 countries listed as recipients of major Russian arms in 2023 marking a substantial decline from the 31 nations recorded in 2019. Several key factors contribute to this dramatic downturn. The ongoing military operations in Ukraine have compelled Russia to prioritize domestic arms allocation to compensate for significant battlefield losses, resulting in a decrease in export volumes. Additionally, the international community's response to Russia's actions in Ukraine, including the risk of sanctions and global condemnation, has deterred potential customers, diminishing demand for Russian arms on the global market. This development marks a pivotal moment in the international arms trade, reshaping the landscape of global military exports. Beyond economic repercussions, Russia's reduced arms export capacity could potentially alter strategic alliances and defense collaborations on the international stage. The British MOD Intelligence Service, which disseminated the CIPRI findings, observes that this decline in Russian arms exports reflects broader geopolitical shifts and underscores the far-reaching impact of the conflict in Ukraine on global military and defense trade networks. In response to the ongoing conflict in Ukraine, Russia has significantly ramped up the production of military equipment and tanks. This increase comes amid the stark decline in Russia's arms exports, resulting in the country dropping to third place in the global arms export rankings according to CIPRI. Despite the substantial decrease in arms exports and the corresponding reduction in the number of recipient countries, Russia's focus on bolstering domestic military capabilities signals a strategic shift towards self-sufficiency and operational readiness. With the need to offset battlefield losses in Ukraine and the decrease in international demand, Russia prioritizes enhancing its own military arsenal over external sales. The heightened production of military equipment, particularly tanks, directly addresses the sustained military engagements in Ukraine. Russia's defense industry operates at an accelerated pace to supply essential military assets to the front lines, aiming to replenish and reinforce its forces engaged in the conflict. This effort not only sustains military operations but also adapts to evolving tactical requirements on the battlefield. The emphasis on enhancing domestic military capabilities reflects the broader implications of the conflict in Ukraine for Russian defense policy and strategy. As international sanctions and condemnation restrict Russia's arms trade, the focus on internal military preparedness signifies a strategic adjustment to both immediate battlefield needs and long-term geopolitical challenges. Furthermore, the increased production of military equipment and tanks underscores Russia's determination to maintain its military efforts in Ukraine despite international isolation and economic pressures. This development may significantly influence the dynamics of the conflict and the strategic calculations of involved parties and international stakeholders alike. That's all for now. See you later.